everyone welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new to my channel you're welcome my name is Corey kane and if you are uh, a returning subscriber thank you for always stopping by guys i thank you so i uh, in today's video i decided to sit down and do a get you ready with me whilst chit chatting but there will be a little bit of a changes in the video uh because guys i'll be doing a voiceover and a lot of stuff that i'll be doing in the video then you'll be seeing as you watch and as you go through the video guys i thank you very much and also guys don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and to also click the bell icon below so that you'll be notified each time there's a brand new upload guys so without further ado let's jump right mm -hmm. in to did my eyebrows off camera guys you know i struggle a lot doing my eyebrows online i need concentration to do it so i decided to do it off camera so i'm back i'm going to show you how i'm doing my eyeshadows guys i will do my eyeshadows first then the rest of the face i will do it and there'll be a voiceover for everything guys so for my face guys i like to usually start off to prime my lids i prime my lids very well with a concealer so I use this kind of a concealer, guys. This is a L'Oreal Paris uh, concealer. This is the kind of concealer I like to use. This is the kind of concealer I try. I usually like to add something onto it. Like um, I like to add a little bit of a cream conceal, cream concealer, cream concealer. So get my cream concealer from this spot and I'll add it a, I'll add a little bit to my eyelids then I start to do it so guys you know what so I like doing makeup a lot I like doing makeup and it's very therapeutic it calms my nerves sometimes when I'm down makeup um, you know makeup um i have told you on this other video of mine how i started my journey on makeup right so there are times when i think of what should i do or when i don't have anything to do at home and i just decide to you know what i might as well do my makeup and post guys and sometimes i do makeup and you know with makeup guys makeup you can do something like you can do like a look and you feel like um this look is not looking the way you want it and you're like ah let me just post and hear what people would say you know people's responses on some certain videos and pictures or things is what it's either it breaks you or it um motivates you so each and every time I pull up a look and I post it, that look to me, it looks like, uh, I just feel like this look is not good to me. I just feel like, ah, this look is not my best. But when I post it on social media, and I also have a hard man at home. <laughs> so, uh, Bay is always like, ah, you know what, this, this look is looking very nice and all that. And I'm always like, oh, no, I'm not feeling it. Then Bay's like, ah, you know what, just post, post it. So Bay picks pictures for me to post sometimes. I'm like, ah, you can pick that one and post that one. That one is very nice. But sometimes to me, I'm like, ah, I don't think I have to post it. What if I post and it doesn't look nice or it doesn't look the part that I want it to look but when I post on social media, everybody's like, wow, wow, we like that. Ah, that makeup is looking gorgeous. A lot of people are post negative, I mean positive comments on the look that I was feeling negative about it. So I'm like, oh, okay. It looks, if it looks nice, guys, then I ain't got nothing to say. So now that my leads are prepped and nicely, so let me just decide to pick colors. Uh, let me pick colors that I like to put, but I will do it on a voiceover. Guys, we'll be chatting on a voiceover. I'll be recording and for concentrating on my makeup, but I will just do a voiceover. So, guys, I decided to put on a back anti color. So, that's the back anti color. I 
I chose, but well before then, I chose the palette called the Poshi palette. It's from the Kura Cosmetics. Kura Cosmetics is one of our local brands here in Zimbabwe. So I picked that burgundy color and I decided to do that kind of a look whereby I'm placing my. So I started by placing that uh, color on my crease. Then I started to blend, blend, blend my color. As you can see, I'm blending, blending to make sure everything is seamless. The key is to blend, blend to your arm full and make sure you blend well. And as you can see, I'm looking in the mirror to check if everything is in place well, well and nice. So as you can see, now I'm blending. So, yes guys, <laughs> that's me, hey. So now as you can see, I'm putting uh, the black color at the outer corner, uh, sort of like an outer V to make sure to deepen the edges so that they will look um to deepen the sides so that the look looks nice and comes out very nice and crafted as you can see it's more like contouring your eyes but using the eyeshadow so i'm putting that uh, black color at the outer corner and blending it blending it to make it look nice and crafted and then afterwards <laughs> I then started to blend so I picked that brush and started to blend I blend making sure I'm at the same I don't blend going out first I start by going blending where I have placed the eyeshadow first it's more like dabbing dabbing then I blend dab dab then blend 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 I get, then get a fluffy brush to Blend the edges, but make sure you hold your brush by the end of the. I don't hold it too close to the, to the um, what do you call it? To the brush, to where the brush, the exact brush is. Hold the, the holder at the end so that you get a smooth and nice blend, guys. So that's what I'm doing there. I'm blending it, blending it, and making sure everything is seamless and looking nice, guys. That's it. I'm looking in the mirror to make sure I'm blending well. I have to blend everything so that they'll be in place. Oh well, that's me we're trying to reach out for something there. So as you can see guys, the look is coming out. The key is to make sure you blend. So that's me now putting the shimmery color on the center of the eye to get that pop effect. Get that pop effect nice and clean. You you have to make sure you find a bright color whenever you are so i chose a shimmery color which was bright i got it from the juvia's place i forgot what's the name of the juvia's place palette but that's the color yeah it's a, oh the blush volume 2 pal, uh, palette so now that's me putting that shimmery color on the to brighten the, uh, the center of the eye so that it looks nice and popping and bright guys that's how i went about it and you have to make sure you put that uh to to remove those harsh lines i had to put them um, to 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 pick the color from the that same burgundy color from the palette and now i'm uh blending the way the shimmery and the, um, the other color meets so i'm just putting a little bit of it there the burgundy color to make everything to infuse it together so that it will be seamless there won't be ash lines so that's what i'm doing right there guys and that's it guys and so i'm trying to reach that means trying to reach i was always reaching out for something <laughs> so that everything is in place so uh, i'll be able to continue with my work and i was i then took the the shimmery color which was more like a a, uh, a pearl I see like an icy what do you call it like an icy gold color like a champagne color that's the one I was trying to to pick so I found it so that's the one I'm popping in my inner corner there
I went on, did my eyelashes, my eye makeup off camera. I'm back. I lined my lips off camera, so I'll be applying my lip stain on the middle of my lips. This is uh, one of the best lip stains I got from Robelin. Robelin is uh, one of our local brands in Dublin. In the shade um, addiction. So I went and did the rest of the face, this is the finished look, I am done guys, we have come to the end of the video guys, I thank you for watching, don't forget to share, like, comment and to give thumbs up to my video which helps my channel a lot, it helps my channel to grow. So guys I'm wearing my lashes, for some of you who don't know it, I have a lash brand, a lash line for my brand and I am wearing my lash um, the style uh, El uh, Elisha and <laughs> this is the little little lashes the tiniest lashes in my collection this is the one I'm wearing guys thank you very much for uh, always watching now that you have come to the end of the video I thank you very much for sitting and watching this video to this end I thank you for your support guys your unwavering support i thank you so 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 much now that we have come to the end of the video guys i thank you so much and i hope to see you in my next one